Hello and welcome to another video of Silkypix Developer Studio Pro. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add clarity in your photograph. Very easy, very simple. Uh, first of all, this photograph was taken in Godonsk, in Poland. This is where the World War II have started. Um, just quickly. Anyway, moving on to the tutorial. Uh, to add uh, clarity, you, first of all, my recommendation is to fix your white balance. Whatever you can do uh, automatic or uh, manual of your choice, but you do your white balance you have to Do your color choice color choice means by whatever color you want to add like sharp uh, Portrait color whatever, but you have to do those first because If you don't do so if you add your clarity first exposure first and then do your coloring later it will affect your contrast or clarity again and you have to probably do it all over again and you might end up overdoing it so my recommendation do those first and then move on your contrast and etc the exposure looks good through the highlights is clipping that's the sky but it's a boring sky it's not really it doesn't have any cloud it's completely white so i can ignore that because the rest of the subjects are well lit so that's done by the way this photo is taken in Christmas time as you can clearly tell by the hat. I tried my best to uh, take the photo without any people but unfortunately uh, you know you cannot really stop them because there are people like five people every ten every second so that's the least I can do. Now you have to add your clarity. Clarity first of all it's another way to add contrast in your photograph. What it does is generally make separate the white from the black so you can add or clarity to add contrast or get rid of clarity to give a bit of moody look so we're gonna add clarity first so don't overdo it again this photo is well contrasty I'm happy but I want to add a little bit of clarity so I've done that what happens you probably can see in the video what is going on but I would like to zoom in first to see the effect so, so I'm going to go to that sections there and go back a little bit pay very good attention to this uh, bright side and the dark side and also play pay attention to the histogram so I'm going to go up a notch a little bit not much change in the luminous section but the photo looks quite nice and contrasty so that's how you add clarity so you already know that you can stop the video right now but I would like to show you if you're still here what if if you get rid of clarity so i'm going to get rid of them what happens this is what happens so uh, wait for the photo to be rendered then you'll see the end result you can tell by the result that you have a little bit of moody uh, mystic look in your photograph it's useful for um, uh, portraits generally portraits most of the time uh, you can also use it for um, a landscape photograph uh, where you want to add a little bit of mist you don't want to get rid of it you instead want to add a little bit of mood in your photograph you can get rid of clarity but if not if you're on a standard clean and nice photograph you can add clarity it should look uh, beautiful don't overdo it though if you go all the way up what happens this is the result it's disgusting horrible you want to call police right now so go back go back as soon as possible run away and maybe and a touch and that's it i mean that's how easy it is uh, i hope this tutorial was useful i'll see you on the next video have a wonderful time bye bye